Hello, welcome to the Behind the Scenes of Joe the Ripper. Um, I'm the director, Anthony Pacino, and this is us mostly getting set up to uh, film the movie. Um, I'm a big fan of just raw footage, raw behind the scenes. Um, I was a big fan of the one they did for uh, Star Wars Episode One, So um, I just figured I would do the same thing for this. Um, as you can see, like with the camera, uh, we use the uh, Z-Cam E2S6. Uh, um, I'm a big fan of the Z-Cam. I actually prefer it over... Uh, you know feature length films that, that use um you know re alexas and reds and this is us showing off the road mic it's the ntg2 mic <laughs> sorry i'm not a sound guy so um per personally uh this is my friend uh his name's raul and he's the one who uh tends to catch the audio in all my films and we always use a road mac mic actually so um this competition was like perfect for us um this is just us catching some footage and you can see chris neil there uh who was my camera operator using a ronin and i'm um, not sure which model that is um and this is us looking over the bloody scene uh the bloody grizzly scene and there i am directing with a backpack on <laughs> um but here's the car scene that we had a shot um it was funny because we were trying really hard to time this out and it just was not working and i put this shot in because anything for the shot right he's literally resting his back against a curb um the original plan for this film was actually to shoot it at a location and i lost the location last second so we had to just kind of come up with something on a whim and this is what we came up with shooting at my apartment and uh, shooting outside the apartment as well. And this is me blocking the scene at the very end there. Um, so um, yeah, it was very interesting to kind of plan everything on the fly, but to keep the most important elements, uh, which is the horror and uh, Jill herself. And um, just to wrap this up, I want to thank Joe uh, Gonzalez for shooting the behind the scenes of this. Um, unfortunately, there's no behind the scenes of her in the film because of that, but um, sometimes that's how things work out. So, thank you for watching.